Almost a year ago, I made a video on how to install Reshade for World and Rise, and today I'm doing an update on that. In this video I will only cover World since Rise works the exact same way, so you can still follow that video if you want to install Reshade in Rise, the link will be in the description. For World, something changed for the better, so I think it's worth making an update. So let's start by downloading Reshade. Click the download button and then download Reshade. And here's the big change, we don't need any injectors anymore, we just need to download Reshade Hook. Trust me, it's so much better. Click on Files and Manual Download. Then you can download whatever reshade preset you prefer. I used Colorful Reshade for a long time and I recommend that one if you just want some color in your game. And in case you're wondering, I'm personally using a modified version of this one. I made a few personal tweaks to it and it's the one I'm currently using. But for this video I'll use the Colorful Reshade as an example. Now it's time to install everything. First extract the reshade preset you want to use and copy it to your games folder. Next, open the reshade setup and select world. Next, select direct X 10, 11 and 12. Here you can go with the easy route or the hard route. If you think you're going to try out a bunch of presets before settling for one, just install all the effects. That will make sure every preset you try out will work and that you won't be missing any effects. I would recommend this for most of you. Alternatively, you can select the preset you want here and go next. This way, Reshade will only download the effects needed for the preset that you selected. Later, if you want to switch presets, you can run the installer again Click Update Reshade and Effects and do the same steps. Again, the easier way would be to just download all the effects. Once you have the effects downloaded, click on Finish. Now, all we need to do is install Reshade Hook. Open your games folder and make a backup of this file right here. I usually copy and paste the file and then I add backup to it. This way I know I won't lose the file. Now rename this file here, dxgi.dll, to reshade.dll. If you can't see the .dll part, come here to View, Show, and make sure File Name Extension is ticked on. Since I already did this before, I'll just cancel it. Now open the Reshade Hook zip file and drag the file onto your games folder. And that's it. Now launch the game and you should see the Reshade overlay popping up. After it's done compiling, click the home button on your keyboard, skip tutorial, and up here select the reshade preset that you installed. And it should be working. Now that you have reshade installed, why not check this video where I show you how to make world look even better with a couple of mods. 